The first of the twelve to die was James the Elder. He was beheaded about a dozen years after Jesus was crucified. James the Elder, the son of Zebedee, the, the son of thunder, uh, sent his mom to ask Jesus if he could sit at Jesus' right hand when he comes into his glory, uh, because it sounded way cooler when James imagined it. See, we imagine Jesus coming in power and glory to, like, you know, be winning battles, to, to be doing cool stuff, to be giving people stuff in, like, cool, miraculous ways. But uh, when Jesus was brought into his glory, he was dying on a cross for sinners to save us from ourselves, to forgive your sins, to save you from death. And uh, that was not for James to sit there. And it was for a thief. You see, when we go looking for power in Jesus, we usually end up missing all the coolest stuff. But eventually, James saw it. He preached the crucifixion of Jesus for about a dozen years until he himself was brought into the same glory. It was eventually time for him to drink of the cup because, well, that's what our Lord would, would dictate. But uh, today, the church remembers the victory even that James has today over death itself.